you just stop praying at least for 30 days? Why can't you just obey the king? Now I've got bad news. Someone saw Daniel praying to God instead of the king. And they tattletale to the king. It was not me. I wouldn't do that. But that means the king sent me to arrest Daniel and have him thrown into the lions. It makes me sad, but I work for the king and I have to do what the king said. It's okay. Don't be afraid. Remember, our faith is in the one true God. So whatever you do, keep praying. Okay? Start there. Guard, take him away. I don't understand why Danny would tell you to keep praying. You guys don't want to become lion lunch too, do you? I told him to stop praying. Man. Oh, Fluffy, there's where you are. I've been looking all over for you. Can you believe these people? I can't either. Daniel could have spared his own life if he had just stopped praying. And he wouldn't do it. What's that? Whoa, I, I, I hear sounds of your big cousins out there, and they sound hungry. It's well, Daniel's a goner, I'm sure. But I do remember that time when the king said he was going to kill all the wise men if they couldn't tell him what his dream was. And you know, Daniel's God told him the dream and what it meant, and everyone was saved. But, oh, and you remember about